power of this constitution lies with the people of Kenya and it has clearly stated that it has delegated that power to the legislature and it states clearly the legislative authority is derived from the people of Kenya. It says judicial authority is derived from the people of Kenya. It says uh, uh, the executive authority is derived from the people of Kenya. The judiciary as well as the legislature, um, uh, uh, executive, and indeed all of us have to follow the principles and the values of the Constitution. We actually went to fight for this Constitution so that the job brethren may have jobs and the power, the, the address may have a place to stay so that the poor may be rid of their impoverishment, they may eat, they may have hunger. Is, it, is this constitutional implement, we got it without civil war. But I still believe, is it implementable without civil war? The rule of law must be used by the judiciary to give fulfillment to human rights. So we must not draw a distinction between them. The rule of law gives the methodology of work of the judiciary, but the judiciary has a constitutional obligation to give fulfillment to human rights. So the two of them are going to go hand in hand in terms of the new constitution. Should we not implement this constitution? Where next? will we go? We must implement this constitution or be ready to cut each other up into pieces.